nice sunny weather today. It sounds like there's some rumblings actually further south. I guess I'll check it out later. And what's going on today? I guess in here they're going to potentially introduce things like drone delivery for pizza. How about this one? It says cloudy with a chance of pizza. Drone company elevates food delivery, raises other applications. As it says here, a drone delivery service with applications for delivering medical supplies and groceries is working with a major pizza chain, bringing flying pizza to the future. It says, you guys might be seeing some pizza from the sky coming to a city near you. Cameron Rowe, the CEO of Hover, told CTV News. Kind of interesting too because as they say, this drone was meant to deliver medical supplies, but I guess technically if you can deliver that, then you can adjust it to deliver whatever you want. In this case, I guess pizza. It says, Rowe explained that a partnership is in the works between Hover and Canadian pizza company Pizza Pizza with the goals of elevating, literally, food delivery for customers throughout the country. Pizza is a competitive market, so we have been working on how they could differentiate themselves with a unique delivery technique that also creates a really fun, novel, and fun experience. Hey, even I would order it just to see what it's like since it's still kind of new in terms of this pizza delivery stuff anyways. And this makes me think of that story from that wing drone delivery where they said it was actually an older couple who kept using that drone service. So will that be the case for these drone deliveries too? Or will it be an older generation that will embrace it right away? It says on a personal level, while Ro was creating this service, he thought of his loved ones. I thought for people like my grandparents who are getting a little older, he said, this is something that could really benefit them. From pizza to emergency supplies, Ro is excited for what the future of drone delivery holds. Having on time, cheaper, more accurate delivery right to your backyard, balcony, or a place of work. It'll come down to, I believe, things like regulations and all that too. I mean, it's one thing to be able to actually carry and transport this stuff. It's another thing to be able to do it, I guess, quote, legally in a lot of places. Either way, they are coming. And in terms of different types of drones, how about this one? It says, meet the British Army's new jet-propelled Hydra 400 drone. The British Army has just showcased its next-generation jet-propelled Heavy Lift Hydra 400 drone at this year's DSEI conference in London. It definitely looks really interesting. It says the British Ministry of Defense officially displayed its latest jet-propelled Heavy Lift drone at the Defense and Security Equipment International Conference at the Excel Center in London this September. Called the Hydra 400, the British Army's stand also featured the drones ate their mothership. A pioneering new generation of heavy lift drones using hybrid propulsion technology, the Hydra 400 is compact and portable, can be transported on a regular pickup truck, and can be prepared for flight in six minutes. It is also, to put it bluntly, pretty badass. Kind of interesting to say this too, death from above. This drone is equipped with a single spool jet turbines to generate 90 LBF, 500 newtons of thrust, allowing it to lift 882 pounds. Imagine this thing falling out of the sky per se if something went wrong. Then again, a lot of this stuff is going to become more normal. Can you imagine this for drone deliveries around your city and stuff, something this heavy? Probably not in the near future, but eventually I guess it will happen.
This must be a drone light show tonight too, so I thought I'd check it out. See you guys later.